I'm using white nurse with the frosty eyes. What I'm doing right now is the Freddy achievement where you have to send 200 oh, yeah. people to the, the dream world. Yeah. Dream world. Yeah, that was fun. That wasn't like that. He, I didn't think his was bad, to be fair. It's pretty easy to do. You just got to hit him. That's all you have to do is hit him once. But <clears throat> if he's they're already like in the dream world, world. You literally had to pull them out of the trap. Wait, oh, have you done I, yeah, but I had people farm with that. Like I was able to just oh, get the survivor farm. to sit there and like it. stepping in the yeah. trap and I'd pull him out. Another one would step in the trap. Uh, I'd I, pull I just, most of the time I would take us to maps like uh, um, uh, Azarov's <laughs> and I would try to set up that middle shack with nothing but traps all over the there was place. no way i was gonna sit there and do that trapper I challenge legit that would have I taken legit, forever I did, I did it yeah it took forever i did it legit i did it in like a couple of games because i just got people to realize like hey i'm not here to kill you all i want you to do is step in these traps and let me yoink you out like 200 times or whatever it was oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, okay so you cheesed it yeah i didn't yeah so it. i would get like 30 in a game or something like that um, yeah, but it, it, not everyone would always cooperate. There'd usually be like, sometimes there'd be like one person that was just cooperating and I would just use them over and yeah. over. But sometimes uh, there were a few games where I got multiple people and they just kept stepping Did in the traps. Achievement. That one was a big pain in the butt too. The only well, ones. You, you have to get them down to with the, get within the gas while they're under the influence. Of I, the I only have three achievements left. One is the night hitting people while they're chased by guards. Okay. One That's is the, the dream demon, which I have 167 of 200. And then I, the last one is Michael Myers. I have 150 of 300. You have to tear up 300 times. Do you, like, and do you have his force 4K for the- I've got everything else besides okay. those three. Yeah, those three are all easy. You'll be fine. It's just going to take a while, the Myers. That, that one will take the, the longest. Freddy's actually going quicker than I thought. Yeah, Freddy's easy. Freddy's is actually pretty easy. So you don't have that many hard ones left. I mean, Myers is just going to take you the ass end of forever just because of how long it takes. To get yeah. Through. So the problem is if I'm going to play Myers, I want to do, um, I don't even know how to use his pools. I, I, I want to use uh, tombstone Myers, but you can't do tombstone Myers for that challenge because so for that what you wanted to do was you wanted to go away from the gen to that wall, LMC wall and put it right in here, like right in here. How many can you put? You can put it. You can put. Oh God! How many can, four? can you hold? Is it four now? It used to be a lot more. It used to be. How so where do we, what do they do? They just slow people down. That's yeah, it. They just slow people down. That's it. That's all you need to do. It's just, it's just hit it. See, like you're chasing him, like like a, a regular M1 killer. You don't need to do that. What I would do is when they. This is the discordance, or this is oh, the, this is eruption. Oh, you hello. So you see my build right here? Thrilling Tremors is going to tell me which gens are. Yeah, no, that's good. So it's that far one. Okay. Problem is, here's a hook. I don't even worry about that. Like, I well, that tells me that tells me to go to this gen right here because this has to be where they're at. Look. Yeah. So, I mean, they, they pre-run. He's right next to the gen. Look at the gen. Oh. <laughs> you could have put a puddle down. You could have put a puddle down in front of him. Alright, so when me... I see them crouch like that and I'm going for that achievement, I just puddle in front of them. And then they have to run into it, giving me a free hit. Okay, so I'm going to put Trail of Torment and Eruption on this. I wasn't even using the puddles. I was just like brute forcing my way. You have to use the puddles, I think, right? For the achievement, don't you? No. You had to get look, it. look, undetectable. And and look at the buff on Trail of Torment. Do you see that? I don't lose undetectable when I hit people. The only way I lose it is they touch that gen there, or or the gen regresses to nothing. Well, you so you stay. Huh? You don't use it with um, Tinkerer either. Tinkerer yeah. runs off in like 16 seconds. Look at me. I'm still undetectable right now. 
<laughs> Look how long yeah, I'm undetectable. Yeah, they, they, but they know, but they know where you are. This is like just. This is it's, just. It's, it's undetectable where they know where you are. Though. How do they like, know they where I am? They don't start out. Why? Because you're chasing them. And, and oh, she, but no one else knows. Yeah. This is not tinkerer level. What do you mean? This is undetectable. I'm completely yeah, undetectable. You're not. You're using. It's a different use case scenario. Because with Tinkerer, you want to sneak up on people. That's the point of using. Well, that. I could with this. Scenario. What would stop me from doing it with this? Because if they go back on the gen, you're going to lose. If they go back on the gen, I lose undetectable, and I know they're at that gen. Yes. So. You know they're at the gen, but you still. So what I know people. right now is that they've never went back to that far gen that I've kicked. They've never Maybe gone back there. These guys are playing like doo doo though. Like, why are they letting you just get free hits up with Freddy? Like, that's all of these hits have been free. Like, what is this? Normally, you don't get free hits like this. Look, they've this gen is still regressing back there. Okay, now they touched it. See that? So I'll fake this. Okay. And and then look, here we are. Why did she run out into the middle of the open? Oh, okay. She, she ran back. She's got the pallet here, right? No, they they used this pallet over here. Oh, well, she's fucked then. Yeah, these people are playing like crowds. Well, the last match they the they were a swift, I think, because they all brought escape cakes and they were an RPD and they were pressuring the gens hard. To pressure them down. Put your puddles in between these little loops. Like when you were there, you could have put a puddle there. Right, and then you put a puddle on the other side. So no matter which side she runs to, she has to hit. The so you just do it mid chase. Yes, yes, that's what Freddy does. They keep, they're not. She's not getting away from you, right? So it only helps you to put obstacles in her way, and you'll know when she hit it. So you, so you got yeah, like that. Well, you don't have to be that that slow or methodical. Just, you know, just put them down really quickly. I guess you just hold right click and then you yeah. let go of it. Yeah, you let go of it immediately. You just drop him all over the place. It, it, he doesn't have oh. a, a slowdown for putting his puddle. He doesn't have any kind of a slowdown on that. So in a way, that's the only redeeming grace that he has for his power. Is that he can't really be slowed down. And they're probably not using... See, this team isn't using their boxes either. And they're not waking themselves up. And I'm not really sure why you you wouldn't, depending on the ad. What add-ons are you using? You're using little. You're using drawing. I think all it does is it it takes away some cooldown of something. Maybe teleport cooldown. I don't know. Okay, so you're just trying to proxy the the gens with them. Okay. You just get get some dream. So demon. remember when you're teleporting. He's invisible a little bit, depending on how long you hold it. And you can use that when you're around the corner to sneak up on people. So what you do is you start your face. <laughs> Look at her with her corner. flashlight. Like, what are you doing? Uh, she's, she's a baby. These people are babies. All right, say that again. So what you do is, like, in that instance, you start your, your fake teleport around the corner, and you become invisible before it finishes, and then you, you cancel it. And then you're invisible when you come up for the hit. So they can't dodge it. Does that make sense? Oh, she's dead too? Wow. I lost you're count invisible. of the hook states. Yeah. With him, you're, in, you're absolutely 100% invisible. What do you mean, invisible? Literally invisible. So, you, most people that, that really main Freddy, they try to stay in a corner, they'll fake a, a teleport. And be, while you're, you're teleporting, he disappears. He becomes literally invisible. Oh, okay. So, like so right here, I'm invisible. The corner. Yeah. Right now, you're invisible. Yeah. And then you. But I can move yeah, when I'm. You can I'm... move while you're doing it. And then you, you literally just invisible move on them. It's almost like phasing with a spirit. Yeah. It's almost, it's not quite a full phase, but it's good for sneaking up on people from around corners. Like if they think you're there, you, what you do is you start your phase, right? You, and then you move around the corner as you do it and fake it. So they can't get away from you because you're invisible. Okay, so let me try it. Let's see, I gotta find some. If someone. you know they're on a gen, yeah. You'll start here, start your fake. I would start, I would start it right then. 
Oh, you're saying don't do... It's not like when you're in an open chase with them? No, no. no. You wouldn't want to do it in open chase. You use it when you sneak up on people. So, like, if you're a trail of Tormented, you would start your fake, come around the corner completely invisible, and then they can't run from you. So, right now... They, can't, they can't get away Okay, from so, you. like, let's say I would... Like right now. I would right here, right fake here. here. Yeah, fake it. See? Exactly like that. Exactly that. He can't he can't avoid it because you're invisible. So let's say I am right here and I start phasing and I come well, around you here. Yeah, you could come around, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You're invisible. So he just he, he takes the That's hit. That's a new way to mind game right there. He doesn't see you. Yeah, it's it's a mind game. It's a complete mind game. That's funny. I wonder if he hears it. Uh, he can hear you attempting to teleport if the gen's nearby, but otherwise he has no indicator. There's no audio indicator of it. Oh, wait. How did he see me? Or he just... He was already there. He already knew you were there. So when he knows you're there, it doesn't really help. The idea is you use it just to sneak up on people, right? If you know they're around the corner and you want to mind game them, you'll 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 fake the teleport and then come around invisible and hit. Them. And it's just it's it's so annoying to go against Freddy's who do that because it's like, well, I guess I just die then because I can't because I can't see his ass because you don't know which way he's gonna come from, right? So they come around the corner basically just invisible. And, you're looking for you're looking for visual indicators because that's how you play against Freddy most of the time. But when you're Fred, but when you're Freddy doing it, you get a better sense of how he actually works when you do that. Here's someone. He's up here. In the locker. Huh. Well, that's it. Hmm. That's all you were gonna get out of that match, anyways. Good job. I could, uh... I could Mori this guy. You do it. Freddy's Mori is underwhelming. His Mori is very underwhelming. Alright, buddy. <laughs> I'm just gonna I wouldn't have even hit him. I think they're begging. I don't know, man. I want to pip. I'm sorry, guys. I really want to pip. Is that a yellow Mori that you brought? Yeah. Uh, I don't think I'm going to... I don't know if I'm going to double pip here. Man, I wish I had saved the games I played today, man. They were great. They were, like, literally on the edge of my seat. Uh, it was sweaty though, I swear. Like, I feel like letting them live. Well, you can only let one live, so pick which one you want. I think I'll pip anyway, if they both escape. Will you? Are I you think so. One? Step in the puddle, buddy. Step in that puddle. <laughs> Oh, so Frosty Eyes and Nurse is a cool one. <laughs> I don't know. I feel bad. I don't want to kill these guys. <laughs> uh, I could pip later, I guess. Yeah, I'll probably. By the way, that buckle up, that buckle up uh, for the people is just broken. When you use for the people with buckle up, you get 20, <laughs> you get 20 seconds of endurance. So I get a little. I get a little uh, confused about it because there's for the people, but there's we're gonna live forever, and then there's another one, and it's like well, all there's these. Made for this, which when they get the pickup, they get 10 seconds of endurance. So there's that one, but there's also buckle up and for the people as well, which is even better because you get for the people and you get the endurance hit. Now, am I gonna? Will I lose points if I let them hit me with pallets? Does that lose points? Uh, I don't think you do. I don't think you lose points for it, but it feels more like Barbie. I mean, do what you want, I guess. Stop. 
stuff in my puddle, sir. Yeah, whatever. They, they're gonna have to do these two gens if they want out, bro. Have you tried the singularity? Yeah. I feel really weak. Every time I teleport to a camera, every time I check a camera, it's disabled. Yeah, it's kind of like that. Always be carrying an M gun. Don't not be carrying an M gun. That's how you counter him. And the M guns are free anyway. You just have to go in the beginning of the match and just kind of slog your way through it. Or just wait it out until you can get an M gun. And that's 99%. Oh, he wants me to kill him? I guess he wants me to kill him. Alright. I'll take it. I'm not gonna because argue. Of that, he's too easy to counter because you can just sit there and wait for the M gun in every case if it comes down to it. Or if somebody else has an M gun and they see that you're in chase, they can imp him as well. And you, so they just get rid of him. Hey, bro, you can have a hatch. I have max destruction. I'm chilling. I, I, I'm definitely going to pit from this. Keep trying to give Hattie outfits. I'm not going to double pip, I don't think. You're not rank one. Nah, I pipped, but look, I almost double pipped. Had I killed that dude, yeah, probably would have gotten. Yeah, you would have gotten your rank one. It's all good. Are you rank two? You're rank two. Yeah. I'm one pip away. Yeah. yeah, I got my rank one earlier, and I was like, wow. Uh, Freddy has a change of heart. So this to this comment I just noticed says, "Hey, you have any tips getting more subs and views on YouTube? I am a, I'm also a DVD content creator, a small one, and you seem like a good person to help me. If not, no. If not, it's okay. Also, you're a great nurse." That's probably an old be comment. Good at a, be good at a dog tier killer. That's the big one. Like Michi, like he does nothing but hack. Like if you want, if you want to be that kind of content creator, like guy has like 300 dedicated viewers at all times on Twitch, and it's just because he's good at hack. Like you get those types of people where it's like they've got a D tier killer that they're like really solid with. There's a guy also that that, that, got, that wrote the 300 page clown manifesto. Have you have you read through that? No. He wrote a guide to clown, and it's three hundred pages. But on his Twitch and YouTube, he consistently has like three or four hundred people who show up just to watch him play clown. <laughs> it's it's ridiculous. But he wrote a three hundred page book on how to play <laughs> clown. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like if if you do that. Like, you will get people who follow you just for stupid stuff like that. Like, if you want to write a is it Is it that in-depth, though, playing it is, clown? It's disgustingly in-depth. He shows you, he walks, he dog walks you through how, how to throw his bottles. Like, the exact precise distances on maps. And how to get easy cross-map throws with bottles. Like, he, like, in every piece of his kit in every map, he, like, walks you through. Like, don't get me wrong, the dude is cracked. He's the best clown in the game, but why clown? You know, 300 <laughs> subs, guaranteed. <laughs> like, yeah, play a D-tier killer like that, and you will be guaranteed. 300 get, subs uh, or 300 viewers? Viewers, at, so like at, viewers. Like, at, a, at, a, at a clip. 300, oh, I'm sorry. 300 on a live stream, yeah. On a live stream, yeah. 